Hey everyone, welcome to ZZ Plays LP of Minecraft, or really more specifically because I was introduced to this uh, as being like a more dynamic, more it complete. It's pretty much almost like an expansion back of the regular game. I'm going to be using the Industrial Craft mod of Minecraft, and so I actually haven't tried anything yet. So yeah, I'm going to have to create, create a new world here. I'm just gonna call it industry. Eh, if I can spell. Um. And so just survival mode. And I honestly don't even really know what to expect. So I did bring along uh my brother. Hey guys. Hey. Yeah, I, I think I, I think I talked about introducing uh my brother to all you guys. And so this is this is my brother Adam. Say hi. Hello. Who apparently just wants to watch me play this game? He he actually showed me this um, mod, which I think will be very cool. It's kind of, it's basically like regular Minecraft, just with more. Um, I'd say it's almost like regular Minecraft, just with more ores. Yeah, and, and things like to work modernized. with. Modernized. Yeah. If oh that's right. What you like. Yeah. There's like mech. There's there's a lot of mechanized things. It's not it's it's not like steampunk. Like you have the powered Minecraft and stuff like that. There's cool things to do it. So, great new world. Here we are generating level. And of course, you know, you get into your basic... Uh, I, I, I don't think it really matters uh, what mod you use. You're basically always going to end up... Oh! And you're in the jungle. Whoa. Hi. I have to... Oh, God. This is skipping a lot. This is weird. Um, Doesn't that oh. usually happen in new worlds, though? Um, kinda. Not this much, I don't think. Okay. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Sorry, guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can uh, not. Oh. Nope. Every <laughs> everything is already already on its lowest setting. So that's a good sign. Yeah, that's a good start, guys. Um. um so they dropped us like literally right in the middle of the forest. Is this new? No. That there's jungle biomes and the yep, I guess, version of the game. Guess we, yeah, I guess we jumped right into a jungle biome. A jungle biome right next to just stone and whatever. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, that was um, weird with the shading. All right, so we spawned a lot next to some chickens, so feathers will probably never be in short supply. Neither will eggs. Um. All right, yeah, I need to start collecting wood. So I mean, this is bit this is basic. Um, I've played Minecraft for quite a bit, so I know I know how basic Minecraft goes, but. So like yeah, for to survive the first night you have to. There, there's so many. There are actually a lot of tutorials on on YouTube yeah, still for how to survive lots. the first night. Um, and the wiki has one too. Yeah. Because honestly, that that's the that's like the one thing. It's just like that that's the one <laughs> problem that that you can run into while playing Minecraft is you jump into it, and it's a great game. But like starting out, you're like, what do I do? Um, like literally, like literally, the first thing you should do is. Like I, I can't actually think of any priorities ahead of just collecting wood. Um, no, not really. I mean, food, but that's farther down the list. Yeah, I mean, I mean, when they when they include the survival mode, you need to. I feel like right off the bat, though, I this might just be an illusion, but off at the start of the game, they give you a while to get to start collecting food. Like you never have like a greater gap of between when you have to start collecting food. I'm pretty sure that's just in the game. you. But um. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> um. Yeah. That like I said, that's that's a very distinct possibility. So we have two different types of wood now, I suppose. Yeah. And yeah. And, so yeah. Wood. and of course, the first thing you do is get a crafting table. And apparently, apparently, this game thinks this is the first time I've done that because I ha I have the benchmarking achievement. Build some sticks. Uh, and make a pickaxe, cause I'm gonna I'm gonna want to get a house like almost right away. Time to mine, yes. Uh, right. We're gonna we're gonna beat we're gonna beat my crafting table with this stick and reclaim it. All right. So so far right now it's not much different than the normal game. No, it isn't um, actually. It's interesting. You only get like new features when you start to dig or maybe. If you want to look for like a rubber tree right now. Um. Now, oh, that that's right. There are 
are rubber trees. Because uh, Adam has told me a little bit about how this works, and that there's like um, rubber and stuff you can get. Um, yeah, so I guess that's one thing. Um, I, I, I was going to say that doesn't really modernize it too much, but it, it kind of does. And like um, rubber, using synthetic rubber is kind of a more modern thing. Uh, so I think that I built this out. To have a, I'm, I'm really glad I, I pulled out a pickaxe now, too. So, I mean, I, I, I swear I must have done this like a... I, I must have done what I'm about to do right now a dozen times, which is just to, like, dig out the uh, proper dimensions for a nice large house. So, I mean, this is this is going to be get kind of boring to start out with. Um, it, it'd be interesting. How, ma how many people... I actually... I think most of the people who play Minecraft now probably use mods like crazy, but I'm, I'm I usually play in the vanilla. So I mean, what do you think? Um, well, I mean, like that's one of the good things about Minecraft. You like make it what you want. Yeah. So that's that's true. I personally like things that add new blocks and stuff to the game, but other people can be more. I'm a, like traditionalist, I guess. Uh, <laughs> I, I it may be impossible to be a quote unquote traditionalist when you play with Minecraft, considering that the game is like, pretty new. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the the only reason I I guess I don't um the only the only reason I don't really go with mods is honestly just because I'm lazy. <laughs> there's really there's really no other good explanation for it. Um. No, I, I don't. I don't want to have like an over. Oh wow, we got flints already. Yeah, and another flint. Yep, and apparently we're running right into a lot of. I'm still beating everything oh, with. Oh god. god. Oh. <laughs> yeah, and we're that's not supposed why you to. Don't dig straight up into gravel. We're not supposed to die instantly right off starting this game. Uh, that's problematic. Is it night yet? Is it night yet? Yeah. No. 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 Probably about midday, actually. Um. Right. I need to... Is it... It's not yet time to start looking for coal, you don't think? No, you, I you mean, need... you can always just make your own coal. Yeah, that's true. I, know. I, I, I have more than enough to make a furnace at this point, and yeah. also some wood. Yeah, that's a good point. If I need to, I can make charcoal. But after, after a while, like, very quickly, the need for charcoal disappears. Just because you, yeah. you, you find coal so everywhere. Cold. Yeah. I honestly almost try to avoid making charcoal, like even in the first place, just because um, you you don't end up using it. And on top of that, it doesn't stack with regular coal. Which <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> Considering they are about the same thing, just in name. Is it, are there any differences in industrial craft? Um. I think in some machines you can only use coal. Oh. Um, <laughs> so that so. diminishes the use of charcoal even more. Yeah. Um, so that's good. But um, the good thing about the industrial craft mod is it adds importance to like other things that aren't used. Um, like, Nearly as much. Yeah. Like iron is used in practically everything you make in the of the new blocks. All right. Where you can easily just get massive amounts of it in the normal game. Yeah, that, that's kind of true. All right, okay, so we we broke that one. Uh, I gotta lay down this. Finally, at, at least we can get a stone pickaxe now at this point. Um, get like, and of course stone. stone picks. Uh, is, is there any? Is there any good? Oh, getting an upgrade. Very nice. Uh, is there any really good application or use for stone for cobblestone? That you like can, you can kind of get rid of your cobblestone. Later, you can put it in a machine called a recycler, which lets you like, which um, like it creates a random, uh, item when you place it in there. Oh. but that comes later. Well, I mean, when, when you get stacks and stacks and stacks of cobblestone, yeah, that's it can really be nice. Valuable. I do feel like um, the, um, for uh, to try to avoid saying that it makes the game easier. Uh, we'll, we'll say, it, it certainly seems that Industrial Craft certainly streamlines the game. 
in in a, in a few ways that it kind of allows you more uh, like some quicker yeah like, methods to getting important things. There's some ways complex ways, but like some ways to make diamonds. It's one component. Right. But Wait, what wasn't it like sixty four coal and one diamond? Sixty four coal and one <laughs> diamond, which is a good way to get rid of <coughs> all that extra coal that you'll most likely get. Yeah, that, that's actually true. You can. Do you know if you can do that with charcoal? Um. Which is I just wood, don't wood know time. because getting that much charcoal would probably be so much Completely more annoying. Completely unnecessary. Yeah. 